Welcome to another simulation video. This is a performance-based question, a drag and drop. Okay, I'll read it down here. You are tasked with labeling this network design. Instructions, objects should be dragged to their appropriate places. Not all objects will be used. How familiar are you with different network interfaces and different network cables? Do you feel good looking at these or do you feel a little nervous? You will be required to know different kinds of basic network cables on the A plus exam. Chances of you seeing it uh, on a picture or performance based questions pretty high. Um, otherwise, you might have a question related to it. So let's get into it. Okay, let's read them. So these are registered Jack 11s, older ones that are used for kind of telephones and faxes. Okay, registered Jack 45. These are for Network interface cards and different things you would see in the home or office. Um, BNC is for a cable. I believe we call these bayonets, bayonet cables. Uh, Lucent connector is a newer fiber optic kind of cable. And a straight tip is older fiber optic cable that you would use. Let's look at the picture carefully before we decide on the answers. So number one, what do we see here? We have two cables from here running to an ONT or an optical network terminal. You would find these kind of terminals outside of buildings or maybe offices or homes or residential areas where people would run a cable to their home modem or some sort of modem. Um, and then it would convert that signal to something that your router could use, and then your router can provide different connections to different devices. Okay, so now that we looked at those carefully, I do wanna emphasize that number one is using two cables, and number four is using two cables. And it is a bit tricky. We do have quite a few options here. So let's start with number one we know that this is where the fiber optic is coming from. I made it very clear that we have either one or two straight tips, or we have a LC. Because this is two, we know we need two cables. And we know the only fiber optic cable that has two is the straight tip. Okay, so I put that on number one. In other environments, maybe you'll see a LC connecting to ONT, but for this one, maybe it's an older uh, infrastructure or something, and we're going to use two ST. Okay, now we have a fiber optic line running here to the network terminal. So for number two, we've got two options left. We can either use an LC or we can use one straight tip. However, to run fiber, you need it to be duplex. You need to send and you need to receive. So that means it's impossible to have one straight tip. You would need a minimum of two. So in that case, I can eliminate and use the Lucent connector. Great. So now we've eliminated the different fiber connections. We're not gonna use this one. Okay, we got three, four, and five. Hmm, what kind of options should we use here? Can we eliminate any of these? Actually, yes, we can. We already know that we're running fiber. We're not running a cable. You can eliminate the BNC. Does that make it a bit easier? Hmm. So number three, we have just one cable, right? So what kind of options do we have? We can run an RJ11 or we can run an RJ45. Well, earlier I said that the RJ11s are for telephones, older things. So you don't want to send that to your home router. So let's use our RJ45. Okay, 
So we've got a nice quality RJ45 going into our home router. Next, number four. We need to run two cables, one to a desktop and one to a laptop. Again, these are just modern equipment that we're using to connect to the internet. So like in any home or any office, you would use a RJ45. Well, it's a little bit too big. By the way, Paint S is a cool program. It's free and you can do a lot of stuff with it. I'm enjoying it quite a bit. Okay, and the last one, number five, we talked about telephones and faxes, older stuff. You might see this in a small office, home office, or just a few devices on a network. There's a ton of places like that where you may need to do work as an IT technician. And there you go. So let's review the answers again. We're running two lines from fiber here. So that's why I use two straight tips because you have to use two straight tips. It only works in um, one way, right? It's one way connection. So if you want two way, you want a duplex and you need to use two of them. We are getting a duplex already from LC. So that's sending and receiving. Okay, it's in the home modem. Now we're converting that signal to our RJ45. We're connecting to our router. We're connecting RJ45s to our desktop, to our laptop. And finally, we got one RJ11 going to our fax. And that's it. Cool, I hope you learned something new. Good luck in your studies. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye.